What's going on guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Fresco and today uh, we're checking out some more Full Metal. All right, let me tell you guys something. I'm a little bit sad, all right? I'm a little bit sad. They got rid of Hughes. They done killed Hughes. Uh, wasn't expecting for him to die. I thought he was going to be able to go right on back home to his daughter and his wife and live happy. But no. Envy had to come and take him out. And now I'm sad. And I'm worried. You want to know why I'm worried, guys? You want to know why I'm worried? Because that means that now... I have to worry about characters and getting attached to them. If I get too attached to characters that are not the Elric brothers, I have to worry that they might get unalived. The Elric brothers are going to their teacher or trainer who taught them how to, how to fight. And uh, apparently their trainer hasn't seen them in their current state, you know, with the an arm missing and an Alphonse being a full suit of armor. We don't know what's going to happen and I don't know what to expect, but we're going to find out right now. So guys, as per usual, all of my reactions are to give you guys a genuine reaction to commentate and review. So without further ado, if you haven't subbed already to the channel, consider if you haven't subbed already to the channel, consider subscribing. It's absolutely free. I post up a new video every single Monday and Wednesday at 10 a.m. Eastern Time and sometimes on Fridays at 10 a.m. Eastern Time. Let's get into this, guys. Oh, is this where she wanted to go? There's more of them! I thought only Ed had a metal arm. Wait, why don't they just buy arms here? Wouldn't it be better? Whoa. But this is good. Come back here a sec. What if you can get a better I arm? Model quite like this mm -hmm. It really is unusual. Everyone take a look. Is is his arm the best arm? <laughs> oh my god! Don't be so rude. They just want a closer look. <laughs> While he's naked? I'm dead. This is why I steer clear of auto mail engineers. <laughs> oh no. What happened? Wrong, they pickpocketed uh, him. No? Or the map? What did you lose? Only the thing that proves I'm a state alchemist. My silver watch. They took his watch. It sounds like you guys had a run in with Benigna. Benigna? Who? A pickpocket around here. Who oh, I... target tourists. Do you know how I can track down this Panina girl? She I see. We saw her. Let's see. Where is she again? I know what might jog my memory. Money. Oh, okay. Never mind. The auto mail shop run by an engineer named <laughs> Oh God! It looks hot as hell. Wow. Absolutely sure we're going in the right direction. Because those engineers could have tricked us. This is all your fault for This was New York and Jersey the other day. You're the one who was dumb enough to let his watch get stolen. Oh, really? Yeah. Hey, you guys. Could that be her? Oh? Oh, a hundred percent. You slimy little cocky. Yeah, go, 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 go. Go ahead. Go ahead, stop her right there. Hell yeah, come on. Unless she's an alchemist also. Ooh. I'd like my watch back. Mm -hmm. That was awesome. How'd you do that, mister? I'm an alchemist. One more. Whoa, you can dodge. Good for you. Wow, so cool. Quick moving around. Oh, this isn't good. Can't catch a little girl. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. I've been waiting for you. Mm-hmm. 
Hell yeah, little bird. Nicely done, Al. Good job, Al. Now, why don't you hand it over? My She's wife. definitely an alchemist. Oh. Come on, you can't be too surprised. You've seen the town, haven't you? That makes oh, sense. Man. Oh. 1.5 inch can, and what do you think of that? Come back. No way. Why don't we see if you can catch me? Oh, you're annoying. Well, now, how do you like that? That wasn't so hard. <laughs> nice work. Now don't let her get away. No way I'm letting her go. Not quite yet, anyway. Not until I've had a closer look at that auto mail. Oh, my God. Oh, hello there, Panina. <laughs> Friend of yours? Not really. Give the watch back, you little thief. Come on. I have never seen craftsmanship like this before. It hasn't Why doesn't Al have guns in his legs? Right? I have questions. It's no use, brother. All the work you've done is simply fantastic. Oh, no, don't look at me, miss. I wasn't the one who made them. Oh? I am. Ooh. Who the hell are you? Grandpa? Huh? This arm seems a bit heavy. Yes, I guess it is. Oh. Want to be more careful not to strain your outfitty. That could be the reason why his growth is stunted. Hey, shut <gasps> up! <sighs> Wait, are you telling me if my auto mail was lighter, I'd grow taller than this? It is a possibility. Whoa, brother, you're so big! <laughs> You guys are tall. <laughs> Next to me, you guys sure look small. <laughs> right. That settles it. Mr. Dominic? <laughs> I beg you. Make me your apprentice. Not a chance, girl. Why? Maybe you'd like more time to consider the idea? No need. I don't Money? Think on apprentices. Oh, I see. I understand, but maybe you can take time out of your busy schedule to teach make him. Auto mail to make me taller. Mm -hmm. it, you little flea. <gasps> That's not nice. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm dead. My old man can be pretty stubborn. That's hilarious. <laughs> A little flea. A little flea. <laughs> yeah. Why does everyone pick on him? Oh, she's Prego. Excuse me, but are you having a baby? Why, no, she just ate. But you wouldn't be able to feel it, right? I think. Could you feel? No, you can't feel. Oh, big head. <laughs> There's a miracle in your stomach. Yeah. Hmm. We were inside mom's tummy like this once upon a time, too. Mm hmm. Oh. Are you oh. Okay? It, yes. Contractions? That's what it's called, right? I'm pretty sure. Mm. Whenever it pours down like this, my stumps always get achy. If you don't mind me asking, what happened? Yeah, what happened to your legs? I was in a train accident when I was a kid. I with see. My parents. I wound up losing both my legs in the wreck. Ooh. I couldn't even walk anymore. Oh my god. I nowhere to go. It felt like my entire world had come crashing down. That's horrible. That's when I met Mr. Dominic, and everything changed completely. Hmm. She's on a wheelchair. She was by herself. No parents, right? The most miserable, pathetic girl in the entire world. Nothing annoys me more than mopers like you. Oh my God! He said I had eyes like a dead person. Probably not far off. I'm sure I really did look miserable. So, without anyone ever asking my opinion, I was outfitted with auto male legs. The surgery and rehabilitation were painful, by far the hardest thing I've ever done. Right. But then... You were able to walk enough, again. I was back up on two legs and I was so happy. All thanks to him. Oh, that's sweet. Dominic, I owe him everything. Hmm. I'm gonna pay him back somehow, even if it takes me my whole life. Of course, he's never willing to take any money from me, so that makes it a bit more difficult. 
<laughs> That's why you're a thief. You're so grateful to him. You should clean up your act and stop picking pockets. Yeah, do something better. He gave you these legs out of a selfless act of goodwill. Mm -hmm. So if you really want to pay him back, use that act as an example. Not by stealing. <laughs> Instead of stealing trinkets from hapless tourists, stand strong on those two legs that he made for you. Stand up and get to work. Yeah, that's right. Mr. Dominic would respect you more for doing that than for stealing. I think so too. Probably. You know what? You're right. From now on, I'll work honestly to pay him back myself. So I should probably give this thing back. I think so. That'd be great. Yes. Hey, what? Uh oh. I think I may have broken it or something. Can't get it to open. Let me see. No, don't worry. It wasn't you. It's been sealed up using alchemy. Mm -hmm. Why would you do that? I think I have a pretty good idea why. Something's in here. He's too embarrassed to let anyone. Oh see. no, she's gonna try to open it. She's not gonna be able to. <gasps> now, let's have a little look at what. It's Edward's probably hiding. a photo of his mom. Oh. Don't forget October third, year eleven. A date. When his mom Here, passed away? You should give this back to Ed. I think. What is it, Winley? Nothing. I'm going to ask Mr. Dominic to apprentice me again. Hmm. <laughs> Did you get it back? What's wrong? The bay. The bay. The bay. The bay. The bay. What about it? Baby? Oh, it was contractions. <laughs> right now? Storm like this, we can't get her to the hospital. Oh no! Are they gonna give birth in the house? Pop will be right back with the doctor. Just hang on a little longer for me. Oh lord! No hanging on here. It'll come whenever it's ready to. Uh, go. What's the matter, hon? It's coming now. Water broke? Sorry, one more time. I couldn't hear that. I said it's coming! Oh, okay, it's coming. <laughs> oh. Everyone, stop panicking, Jesus! How? Deliver it. Well. So, so you've seen a baby being delivered before? No, I, I haven't. But we don't have any other options here. I need everyone's help. They're screwed. We are going to do this. Now, <laughs> go and get me some boiling water. Sure, Winry. Anina, go find some towels and hurry. Okay. Mr. Riedel, do you have any rubbing alcohol we can use for disinfectant? I think we have some in the storeroom. Oh, rubbing okay. alcohol? We'll put them by Miss Atera's bedside. What's the rubbing alcohol for? I don't know anything about childbirth, y'all. Don't ask me. Don't even look at me that way. She comes from a family of doctors. She grew up reading medical textbooks instead of picture books like most Oh, I see. Okay. That's all well and good, but it isn't exactly the same as a medical degree. Yeah. It's clear that she at least vaguely remembers some of it. Some Does she, it. though? Right now, the only choice we have is to defer to her knowledge and the sheer force of her nerve. Does she, though? <laughs> Hopefully, Dominic can make it back. Water, disinfectant, towels. And what else was there? Remember it now. Winry. You, you can, can do, do this. this. Mm hmm. Paninia, give me a hand in here. Sure. You got it. The name Paninia reminds me of Panini. Or I'm just hungry. One of the two. I don't know. I know nothing about child childbirthing. Oh my god. I think it'll be fine. I know we're not big believers in God. Maybe he could help us. This once. Uh 
I think he'll make it back, right? Brother. What? They did it. Uh, right? Oh, that blood. I can't do it anymore. Jesus Christ. Did you do it? I think you did it. What's I think she on? did it. You did it. Hey. Uh, it's a baby. Oh, so small. It's a baby. Hooray! <laughs> it's a real life baby. Awesome. awesome. It's a full head of hair. To describe this? Uh, how else should I describe it? This is the birth of a new life. How can this have worked for centuries and we're still not able to do that? A person creating another person. Mm. You've got to be kidding me. Maybe I see. In alchemy with the miracle of birth? Wow. Occupational hazard. It's just the way I think. <laughs> Besides, it's a lot of hair. It is awesome. People are awesome. <laughs> All right. The baby's born and everything's good. So do you think there's anything else you're going to need me for now? Yeah, there is. Do you think you could pick me up, please? Huh? It's humiliating to be carried by a boy who's smaller than I am. Wow. I could easily drop you, you know. Eh? Huh? What is it? I saw it. The engraving that's inside your pocket watch. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Ow, that really hurt! Forced it open. Why did you even say anything? I'm so sorry. <sighs> you idiot. <laughs> yeah. I haven't shown that to anybody, not even Al. But why not, Ed? It's private. An admonition to myself. I hate to admit how weak I am, but I had to give what happened that day substance and then carry it around with me as a reminder. I see. Oh, yeah, okay. The day everything happened, right? Why are you doing that? What are you crying for? Mm hmm. Oh, there's no turning back for us now, brother. Hmm. Oh, it was the day that they burned the house down. What are you crying for, Winry? You two won't cry. Someone else should do it for you, don't you think? Don't be an idiot. Hmm. You should get back to Rizambul. You've been gone a long time. Granny must be lonesome without you. No, I'm not leaving. Why? Is Granny okay? Resolve inspired me. I want to do more, Ed. I can't just commit halfway. What do you? There's no need to get more involved. We don't want to put you in danger either. I want to hone my skills so I'll be able to make you the finest quality automail prosthetics. Okay. You can continue your journey knowing you're as strong as you can be. So stay with Dominic. I'm going to try again. I'll ask Mr. Dominic to make me his apprentice. Mm hmm Okay. Well then, good luck. Hmm. Winry, Mr. Riedel said he wanted to talk to you for... What's up? Is there something wrong? Oh, no, don't worry. It's nothing. I'll be right there, okay? Paninia. Hmm? Yeah. Mother and baby both look perfectly healthy. It seems like the delivery was handled expertly. Well done. Sometimes even adults can't take being present at childbirth. Good job. Oh, well, we did what we had to. That's all. We are truly in your debt. What you did was amazing. <gasps> He'll teach her now. Especially you, young lady. Uh, He'll teach her now. Please, sir. There's really no need to thank me. Oh my goodness. Now you're gonna make me blush. Oh. <laughs> Maybe you could make an exception and take on an apprentice. Yeah. It has nothing to do with the other. I don't take on apprentices, and that's that. Wow. But if that's what your heart's set on, 
I can recommend you to an accomplished engineer at the base of the mountain. Oh? Really? Pardon me. Would it be okay if I came by and watched you work sometimes? I won't stop you from coming once in a while. Hmm. See my grandchild. Same goes for the tomboy. <laughs> Who's that? Who are those guys? That was a little random. Now you two be careful. You too, Henry. Thank you. And don't forget to call Granny and keep her posted. Oh please, like you're really one to talk, Ed. And make sure to steal that old man's technique so you'll have something even better for me the next time I see you, okay? Oh, she's gonna stay there. Check in on Granny though. Make sure she's okay. Gone. They'll be back. Hmm. Da. Hmm. One is all. All is one. Who's this guy? Whoa. What just happened? We've almost reached the Dublin station. What was that? Were you having a dream? Yeah. I was dreaming about him. Ooh. Who's him? Who's him? Hello. Who's We're him? Finally here. Yeah. <sighs> It'd be nice if teacher wasn't home. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Uh, hello, Sig. Long time no see. Sig. Good to see you. You've grown up a little, huh? He's squishing me. <laughs> you probably don't recognize me, but it's Alphonse. Sorry we've been away so long. Looks like you've grown up more than a little. No one's patted my head like this since back before I lost my body. <laughs> Izumi. The Elric Shrimps have come for a visit. Elric Shrimps is crazy. I'll be right there. I'm feeling a little better today. Oh, Izumi right is the... That's not a good sign. Is the it's trainer. Since last time. <gasps> what? Oh! <laughs> Hello, my stupid not the chunklas. My God, your skills are rusty. You've got lots of energy for someone who's not feeling well. Not feeling well? What are you talking about? I'm perfectly. Oh, she's dying. <laughs> you shouldn't exert yourself. How sweet of you to worry, dear. What's going on? Oh, it's is it is it husband and wife? Oh, okay. It holds no interest for me. <laughs> I see. Okay. There was that one alchemist. I thought that one man from Central knew a good amount about the stone. Uh -huh. Ooh. So who was this guy? Let me think. What's his name? Ah, uh, Hohenheim. Hohenheim. Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Why does he look like him? Is that his father? What is it? No, it's not. It's not, he's right? Alive. Someone you know. Oh god. He's our father. I knew it! The one who ran out on you when you were little? I <laughs> yeah, that's knew the it. He looked like him. Same hair. It's because of that bastard that our mother Oh did. no. It wasn't for him. I knew it. Oh, you boys are up early. What are you doing out of bed? Oh, look at Al. And of course his big brother took care of him. Thanks a lot, little man. Hmm. Oh, you look... You look not nice. Oh, 
Hohenheim, huh? Okay. Hey, why isn't Dad here? He left. Your dad left. Mm -hmm. When's he coming back, Mom? Not coming back. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. <laughs> you silly boy. She was so optimistic. Before you know it, Al. <laughs> now, finish your dinner, boys. Mm -mm. It was just her. Yeah, I see. She's all they had. She's all... She's all they had. Um, did our dad say anything about the Philosopher's Stone? Something about a lifelong dream coming true. He seemed very happy when he said it. No. Ah, now we're going to <laughs> Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Damn, I'm hungry. Morning, you know. You oh, can't eat, no, man. I'm fine. I had a big meal on the train right here. Hey, Al. Huh? You should tell her about Rush Valley, about the baby being delivered. Oh, yeah. We hmm. helped deliver a baby. There was this big storm and we couldn't get the mother to a doctor. I don't know. It's pretty generous to call what we did helping. <laughs> yeah, it was mostly windering. So what exactly is wrong with the trainer or teacher? The mother was so brave. Everyone's blessed when a baby's born, huh? Yes, that's right. That same miracle brings us all into this world. Always take pride in the lives that we're giving you. Hmm. <laughs> Why did he make that face? Hey, Ed. Hmm? Teacher hasn't changed, has she? Nope. She hasn't changed one bit in all hmm. this time. Stack them up tight. We need more. Collapsing. <laughs> Oh, this is when they met her? This must be when they met her, huh? Is she an alchemist? Oh! She is! Like Al! I mean, like Ed! It's like the same, uh... It's the same alchemy. Lady, who are you? Just the housewife who was passing by. That's oh, she's dying. <laughs> hey, old lady, could you be our teacher? Old lady is crazy. <laughs> Pretty please, old lady. I'm a little hard of hearing, you see, so I didn't quite catch that. Maybe you'd like to repeat yourselves. <laughs> We'll try again. Please, please teach us, pretty lady. There you go. No way. Why not? Oh. Because I don't take on students. And besides, I'm in the middle of a trip. But please, <laughs> teach us. <laughs> what about your parents? Um, ma'am, these little ones don't have any parents. <laughs> How am I supposed to say no to that? Oh. This is where they learned, huh? You two are on your own. Huh? This is your introductory training. If you do well, you'll move on to the main training phase. During this first stage, the use of alchemy is totally forbidden. What? How do you survive? And all is one. You have one month to figure out what that means. One month? You find the answer in the allotted time. If not, you're headed back to Risenborn. Oh my God. No way, they left him on an island. No shot, dude. <laughs> I'm so hungry. 
You got a fish. Eat some frogs. Maybe a gecko? Maybe do a little bit of hunting? It's surviving. <laughs> Me too. You know what they say, no better teacher than experience. Mm. This is the best way for them to learn the essentials of alchemy. Mm -hmm. I'm teaching them the same way that I was taught. Survival. If they don't learn anything from this. It means their talent as alchemists will be limited. And I'll have to give up on them as pupils. Okay. Wow. It's not their education I'm worried about. I can't believe this. Their lives could be in danger out there. Nah. They're not doing anything that I haven't. My training began with a whole month in the Briggs Mountains in winter. <laughs> <laughs> I know you shouldn't compare yourself to normal people. That island has plenty of things to eat. They're not going to die. You gotta go hunting. Oh, they got something! Got oh, <laughs> no, little bunny! Kill it. Kill it. <laughs> no, not the bunny! <laughs> ah. <laughs> Go get fish. <laughs> go get fish. Go get fish. Oh, it's gone now. Yep, it's gone. I can't believe this. Oh my god, this the circle of life, huh? Uh. Bingo. Wait, how are we supposed to get the fish? We don't have any rods or lines. Make a spear. Get some wood, a long branch, and then, you know, you chop it up. Make it into a spear. Here we are. No food, no fire, no nothing. Don't remind me. How many days has it been without food? Five, six, six days. Okay. Come on. Do they know alchemy yet in this in this part? Oh my god! Don't no. stop it. <laughs> oh no. Are you going to eat ants? brother? Uh, I'm still alive. I'm alive because I ate the ants. Are you gonna are you gonna eat ants? I'm alive because I consumed life. I'm still alive. Okay. We're not going to die. Hmm. Oh, they're doing it, they're doing it! There we go. Just keep going a little Trying to make fire. <laughs> yeah, you could share a little piece. That's fine. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> Damn. sure about this but do you remember when i was weak from hunger and i ate those ants mm -hmm. i ate a lot of them <laughs> i sure did and boy did they taste nasty i but bet that, that got me thinking if i hadn't eaten them i might have died then i would have been eaten by them i'd go into the earth and become grass and then the rabbits would eat that you're talking about the food chain right yeah but it's not just that either 
Long time ago, this whole island was probably at the bottom of the sea. And tens of thousands of years from now, it could be the peak of a mountain for all we know. All things are connected. Mm. Is that what you're saying? Everything we see. Jesus Christ. We meet is caught up in a great unseen flow. This is getting deep. But it's bigger than that. It's the entire world. The entire universe, even. And compared to something as big as that, Al, you and I are tiny, not even the size of ants. We're only one small part within the much greater flow. Mm -hmm. Nothing more than a fraction of the whole. Jesus Christ, my brain! Together, you get one great all, just like teacher said. The flow of this universe follows laws of such magnitude that you and I can't even imagine them. Hmm. Today is the day. They did it. Let's hear what you've learned about one is all and all is one. All is the world. And one is me. <laughs> Very well. <laughs> now the real training starts. <laughs> Let's go. Is the power of the circle, which denotes the circulation of power. In order to call Teaching them how to fight the and the alchemy at the same time. Oh. This is also the circulation of power. <laughs> it's best if you experience it for yourself. She's a thug. <laughs> <laughs> Enough of that. Keep reviewing the morning's lessons until lunch is ready. Let's see. The circle denotes the circulation. That is not a circle. In order to call upon and harness this power, one must draw a structural matrix over the circle. Does it have to be a perfect circle? You just put your palms together to perform transmutations, don't you? Yeah, how do you do that then? You can do it without drawing the structural matrix? If you think about it a certain way, I myself am the matrix. How do you do it? Tell how us do you do you. that? Perhaps it's something you learn when you see the truth. Oh. <laughs> Our teacher has seen the truth too. <laughs> About human sacrifice? Huh. So, what is it you wanted to ask me? She does know. Oh, 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 oh. Well, I'm sure he's doing better than before. Oh, that's why he has a spear. As I suspected you can transmute without a matrix. <laughs> On top of which, Al is now a suit of armor, and two of your limbs are made from auto mail. Teacher, how did you know? She <laughs> knows. Sparring with you. She knows. You saw obviously. It, didn't you, Edward? <laughs> mm-hmm. It seems both of us are beyond help. <laughs> you saw it too. Could you tell me? How did she see it though? Who did she try to bring back? <gasps> that's why! Oh, that's why she could do it! Did she lose something inside? It makes sense. <gasps> the baby? No! It was a baby! For a while it seemed we were barren. We wanted a child but couldn't conceive. Oh! Uh... Able to conceive, I ended up falling gravely ill. And our child as well. He was not able to take a living breath in this world. That's why. So, That's why she could do it. The taboo. As a result, I lost parts of my inner organs. What an idiot I was. Jesus Christ! Uh... Now I realize I should have told you sooner. How long does she have to it live? Is she dying soon? So sad. I did it to myself after all. It hasn't been that big a deal, actually. That's a freaking lie, yeah. List of things I get to look forward to eating when I have my body back. 
Right, brother? Yeah, it's nothing. You darling little idiots. Hmm. It's okay to hurt. Forgive us. We're so sorry, teacher. Please forgive us. We're so sorry. Please forgive We're us. We're so sorry. The flow of this universe follows laws of God damn. This show makes me cry more and more. You have to understand that flow, deconstruct it, and then reconstruct it. Getting all teary eyed and whatnot. That's what alchemy is, brother. You're right. It's also what living is. Mm hmm. So the basis of alchemy, deconstruction and then reconstruction, is just like the food That's what you guys food. always tell me. When That's what it was. It and your body breaks down its flesh, then it's restructured as part of yourself. Okay. And even before that, the rabbit restructured the grass it ate into part of its own body. Oh god, that's just so much for the brain. And the flow is life itself. So much for the brain. I could never six weeks hmm i didn't even think about that on how she was able to transmute just by clapping it didn't even it didn't it didn't even cross my mind to think about that and when they were talking about a baby they had that look in their face i should have pieced it together but it makes sense right she that means that means she did it so long ago because she was able to save all those people from the from the from the tides, right? And she also just clapped her hand and was able to make all that land go up, right, from the ground. It makes sense. So, oh my God! But they, she she didn't teach Ed how to transmute by just clapping. He learned that on his own. But she did teach him how to fight. But that's so sad. That's so sad that. Again, just like, like, just like the brothers, they try to bring someone back to life, and they paid a price for it. It's kind of crazy. Uh, what What's gonna happen when they go back and they find out that Hughes is no longer alive? And where the hell is Scar still? Is Scar now going to focus on trying to get rid of lust, envy, and uh, and gluttony? Or is he still going to be focused on trying to take out the Elric brothers? I guess we'll find out. Guys, if you enjoyed, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. So that way you get notified when I post up a new video. I post up a new video every single Monday and Wednesday at 10 a.m. Eastern Time and sometimes on Fridays at 10 a.m. Eastern Time. Thanks again, and I'll be seeing you in the next episode of Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Later, guys.